Out of all the things to do in Bishop Arts District, it's hard to figure out exactly where to begin. Here on the scene and all around town, you'll find purple ribbons like this one and people wearing purple ribbons to show support for Alana and her family during this time of tragedy. Texas is one of two states that prosecutes truancy cases in adult courts. However, parents and students of DISD believe this is a violation of their basic human rights. Water main breaks actually occur every day. Now it's the big ones that require pipes like this that experts are trying to prevent from getting out of hand. What's so special about this program is what they call the petting zoo, where kids can touch or even play the instruments. It's exactly what they didn't want to find, but they found at least one zebra mussel here at Lake Louisville. The zebra mussel found here at Louisville Lake was literally as small as this tiny black rock. Now look how small that is in comparison to this white shell. It's crazy how something that small can make a huge impact on the entire lake. Teresa Woods is in the boat business, and she's always on the lookout for zebra mussels. We don't want them. We don't want them in our lake. She hasn't seen any, but biologists found one near the dam at Lake Louisville. Zebra mussels can latch onto boats by the millions and clog intake pipes that are part of municipal drinking water systems. I was assuming by next spring you'll start seeing them on boats and things like that, maybe even by the end of this summer. Boaters worry too, and some pick the lake hoping they wouldn't have to worry about zebra mussels. Be watching for them and, you know, look on my boat and everything when we get out of the water and just make sure they're not there. It is important to pay attention to the various signs around the lake and take caution to zebra mussels. Alex Phillips, CBS 11 News.